press any button to get started with Mass Effect. Okay. Talk to the Turtle. Research assistant Elizabeth Bainham. What can I do for you? Already experiencing issues? No, we're good. Okay. <laughs> what do you know about the Geth? I have no specifics on the Geth as they relate to this facility. All sensors have been purposely decommissioned since their arrival. Uh oh. I want to know about Exogeny. Exogeny Corporation is at the forefront of human expansion in the new galactic economy, <laughs> funding colonial development and securing resource rights to ensure our progress. Resource as species. rights. That's fun. Further inquiries regarding company policy may be directed to consumer information services during regular business hours. Who's in charge here? Who organized the research? All decisions about local resource analysis and acquisition are made. Individual employee records are confidential. Uh oh. Tell me about the Thorian. Species 37 was discovered several weeks ago when a small team was infected with spores while examining ruins near the Zoo's Hope outpost. The outpost was quarantined immediately and study of the infection began. Within 21 days, 58% of colonists exhibited altered behavior. Within 28 days, 85%. What's the size of this thing? The Thorian appears to be a diffused creature. Its cognitive abilities are centered in large nerve bundles, but it received data from kilometers of meandering tendrils. We have discovered bundles approximately one meter in diameter, but these seem insufficient to coordinate the massive sensory potential it possesses. Huh. It may simply process such stimulation slowly, or perhaps there is a nerve cluster of a greater magnitude we have not yet encountered. Is it intelligent? Can I reason with it? The Thorian does not exhibit the focused behavior of a predator. The release of spores is an act of survival, not aggression. It does trigger advanced behaviors in the humans it enslaves, but we have yet to discover whether it recognizes or is capable of recognizing humans as more than tools. It is sufficiently alien as to defy classification at this time. Do you know how the creature... The will subversion manifests as intense pain will directives are ignored. The effect is severe enough that subjects are soon conditioned against even minor thoughts of rebellion. Observation suggests the Thorian views its thralls in a utilitarian way. Care is apparently taken to avoid injuring them, much as a craftsman avoids damaging his tools. As long as no action is taken against the creature's objectives, the subjects are free to pantomime a normal existence until specifically tasked with something. Where's the center of this thing? The Thorian is present as a weave of tendrils across much of the lower surface of Theros. Observation of enslaved subjects suggests there may be key clusters that are tended by thralls. Unfortunately, direct observation of species 37 is limited or non-existent. Please access my personal files. Elizabeth Bainham, research assistant, biomedical. You are currently under probation due to disagreements with management over established company policy. These sanctions may be lifted Why if your next I evaluation sanctioned? is more agreeable. What triggered the probation? You were marked as combative about the operations of the Zoo's Hope Project, specifically regarding the handling of the infected colonists. You think? As a result, you were tasked with monitoring the safety of the colonists for the duration of the observation. Going to standby mode. All right, cool. Pistol still equipped? All right. On my way. Now, will they just... Now, here's the real question. Will they just stand there? No. I'll have to figure something out. Because obviously we want as little depth as possible when it comes to <coughs> the uh, people who live here. Perhaps, but very efficient. How do we cut the power if it's coming from the ship? It will be difficult. We can check the other claws for weaknesses. But the Geth are very thorough. This structure seems to have significance for the Geth. A temple of sorts. The Geth blur the line between organic and synthetic life. It's natural to assume they seek understanding from a higher power. This structure seems okay, to have so that, that was why she started saying that. Is it possible 
to set up this room to serve as a sacred temple of sorts. The guests blur the line between organic and synthetic life. It's natural to assume they seek understanding from a higher power. <laughs> The Krogan! Kick a man while he's down. And then proton rounds, okay. Uh... <clears throat> I guess I keep going. Well, I just fucked with the server node. Maybe that turned it off. Maybe I wasn't supposed to... Oh, wait. Or I can go down this way. What do you think? Heat ability is fantastic and I hate it so fucking much. It's so useful. <clears throat> and like, you know, it's the smartest thing they do. And I hate it. <laughs> Confidential. <clears throat> The test samples were due to arrive three days ago, but we haven't heard anything of the colony or the cargo vessel. We suspect the samples became volatile and recommended cutting off all further contact with the Notocrux colony. Even if the colony is discovered, no one should be able to trace the events there back to us. You think, buddy? Gotta run through the fire. Nope. Probably up the stairs like a rational person. Same as before. We don't have the ordinance to blow this cloth. Let's keep looking. Even 
private log of Dr. Gemrolle. I don't trust the Cerberus group. They may pay us well, but if this gets out before we've developed an antidote, it's just not smart. They won't tell us what they want the samples for or why they wanted them delivered to the Matsuno system. My records show nothing of interest there. A repair ticket attached to the console. The damn door to the shuttle bay is fried again. Works fine if the PSI is 30 or lower, but the safety the safety shutoff kicks in if the PSI gets above 34. But if the PSI is in the 31 to 34 zone, the door slams down with enough power to shear through metal. Uh, someone please fix this before my team loses an arm. Alright, so we have to get it to 31. Isn't that what we want? Oh, I thought it would do it automatically. That is like so fucking sexual. <laughs> Damn, was no one in that fucking ship? Very good. The field barring the exit will be down. Now we can go deal with the Storian creature. I hope that ship was full of those geth bastards. I repeat, Norman need a shore party. Are you reading? Anyone there? Is that you, Joker? What's We're going on? We're in lockdown here, Commander. Something happened to the colonists. They're banging on the hull, trying to claw their way inside the ship. They can't do any real damage. Uh, We're on our way back. Yeah, okay. Well, we'll just wait right. I don't know what I just said to my teammates. I once again. Not worth it. I'm not opening that. A lot of fire everywhere. You know, just making a note of it. All right. This is going to be this is going to be a little hard. some answers I I was a, when the geth attacked I stayed behind I tried to tell them where to find the place I I never meant for this to happen you did what you could I'll help them if you can tell me where to find the Thorian the Thorian is underneath Zeus hope but the entrance is blocked the colonists covered it with the freighter just before the geth attack but why are the geth after the Thorian well it does have unique mind control capabilities that's what exogeny was interested in Norman need a shore party. Come in. What is it, Joker? We're getting a lot of Geth comm chatter. Looks like they're headed your way. Thanks for the heads up, Joker. You heard the man. Let's move out. I'm coming with you. I might be able to... You probably can't, but... But I appreciate it, I suppose. There's our ship. You can't unequip things, right? No. 
I could just give them better gear. Why would I do that? When I could have the better gear. For a gun I probably will never use. Yeah, we didn't kill anybody when we, at a certain point, we gave up. <laughs> we got ourselves a trophy! I was gonna, don't worry. I like that we could just leave though. You can't do this, John. Everyone shut up. Uh, let me think. What's going on? You won't get away with this. Get her out of here! Get away from her, you son of a bitch! Lisbeth! Damn it! Come, come out where I can see you! All of you! Oh, Shepard. Damn it. I knew it was too much to hope the Geth would kill you. I found some interesting facts about you in the Exogeny database. I know what happened on a cooze. This doesn't have to end like that. We can talk this out. You, you don't understand. Communications are back up. Exogeny wants this place purged. This is a human colony, John. You can't just repurpose us. It's not just you. There's something here far more valuable than a few colonists. You're after the one unique thing Pharos has. The what? It's a telepathic life form. It's taking control of the colonists. You won't get away with this, So you John. keep saying, but nobody's gonna miss a few colonists. Can't you see the inherent potential in this colony? Opportunity? Pitch it as humanity against all odds. Nice! Yeah, I guess it could be left to... Sadly, you'd probably make a killing. But if it will let us get back to... Just our... might work. Wait, no, but, but the infected colonists will throw a bit of a wrench... You can't in. just kill If you colonists. kill only the Thorian, it might be enough to stop the infection. Maybe... It's worth a try, but I don't know... There if... has to be another way. Maybe there is. Come and talk. Sure there's no evidence when you're done. I'm glad you've decided to help us. I think there's a way to avoid killing the colonists. What'd you have in mind? I think you could safely use a nerve agent to neutralize the colonists. Like a gas grenade. Releasing clouds of nerve It's gas. not like it's weapons grade. The insecticide we use in the grow labs, if their nervous systems are already weakened. A reduced capacity concussion grenade might suit our Sounds needs. good. Excellent. Thank you. Okay. Anti Damn it. Oh no, there it is. I'm the only one with grenades. Okay. All right, let's get out of here. I was hoping you'd have a moment to speak with me. I don't really have time to I, speak. I need to retrieve some data. It's not a big deal. Sounds easy enough. No catch, really. It's what big. is it about you that makes people <laughs> assume we enjoy being in harm's way? It's not that bad, really. All you need to do is find my console at Exogeny headquarters. I'll look around if I get the I appreciate it. Is all depends on getting out of Time here. to get moving. Just keep it Damn, I should have talked to him before. 
Oh well. Might not ever finish that quest. Cause I'm not going fucking back that way. Okay. Here we go. Bye guys. Get the fuck up out of here. No, don't. Oh, we can kill. No amount of infection could have altered a human to that extent. No human colonists. Even if the Thorian makes them. As fire. you order, Commander Shepard. Alright. Let's just go, just go, just go. You gotta hit X. How many grenades do I have? Three? Admittedly, I accidentally wasted one, but... I only had five. Okay. We're gonna make a new save. The second it will not let us. Now it will. Choose a new one just in fucking case. They automatically shoot at her. I know where it goes. So far, so good. Okay, so it's over there. Fuck off. Oh, that's Liara, okay. Bitch, I am not in combat. Alright, fine. Oh no, they're... One's almost dead! I'm not in fucking combat! God damn it, dude. 
dude. This is bullshit. Now what? Now what do I do? Take cover. Well, let's go see if I can find some fucking grenades, I guess. If I knew they would follow me, I should have just made them follow me. Upgrade kit. Grenades, grenades, grenades. Don't you fucking dare, you absolute fucking buffoon. Alright, whatever. Alright, well I know where more grenades are. Keep hitting select. Go to sleep. I was about to flip my gourd if it somehow did not get both of them. Where's the other one? There we go. No, uh, you. Fucker! <sighs> Hope it's not gonna be a fucking problem. Why didn't you throw one of your grenades, dipshit? Also, he doesn't count? Damn. S Savage. Should have saved, realized I didn't. Renegade points? What? What did I do that was a renegade? I mean, truly. Uh, put the last point in technical armor. Did I save? Huh. 
Well, that seems neat. I don't drink coffee, though. But that's very nice, anyway. Alrighty, what are we doing here? Alright, we just need to find this creature and determine what it... What it... Keep. What is that? <laughs> does not look like any plant I've ever seen. This may be problematic. <laughs> no, no, no. What are you talking about? It looks like a fucking, you know, like a... I was about to say ramen plant. Why the fuck can't I think of the name? Aloe vera. Ew. Invaders, your every step is a transgression. A thousand feelers appraise you as meat, good only to dig or decompose. I speak for the old growth as I did for Saren. You are within and before the Saurian. It commands that you be in awe. You gave something to Saren, something Saren I Saren sought knowledge of those who are gone. The old growth listened to flesh for the first time in the long cycle. Trades were made. Then cold ones began killing the flesh that would tend the next cycle. Flesh barely given. The old growth sees the air you push. And Give fly. me what I need and I'll strike no back. No more will the Thorian Your blood will Alright, I don't give a shit. Give a fuck. I think you have to kill no matter what. I could be completely wrong, I don't not gonna react though you don't uh, kind of give a shit okay you know what whatever why don't we just look for the next Why do I keep, what was there a game where fucking select was the grenade button? Wow, I've never reached the uh Coming through. I'm really looking patched if we're going to be honest with ourselves. It can't be fucking upgraded, dog. Nothing 
fucking can be, though. thought about not dying that's the old lady Do I have actually better armor for her? I wasn't paying attention to see if I did. Yeah, this is a good mod to have on here. That friendly fire is not on, because how many times would I have fucking...
none are as good. Damn. I should thank you for releasing me. Is everything all right? Are you I'm hurt? fine, or I will be in time. My name is Shiala. <laughs> I serve. I, I served Matriarch Benezia. When she allied herself with Saren, so did I. I came to this world in search of a Thorian. Saren needed its knowledge, and he needed my uh -oh. biotic abilities to communicate with it. Saren offered me in trade. I was sacrificed to secure an alliance between Saren and the Thorian. Saren's pretty quick to betray his own people. He was quick to betray the Thorian, too. After he had what he <laughs> wanted, he ordered the Geth to destroy all evidence of its existence. Saren knows you are searching for the Conduit. He knows you are following his steps. He attacked the Thorian so you could not gain the Cypher. What's the Cypher? And why did Saren need it? The beacon on Eden Prime gave you visions. But the visions are unclear, confusing. They were meant for a Prothean mind. Uh -huh. To truly comprehend them, you must think like a Prothean. You Eat like a Prothean. Their culture, their Fuck. History, like their a Prothean. Very existence. The Thorian was here long before the Protheans built this city. It watched and studied them. When they died, it consumed them. They became a part of it. So the Thorian taught Saren to think like a Prothean. The cipher is the very essence of being a Prothean. It cannot be described or explained. Fair. It would be like describing color to a creature without eyes. To understand, you must have... I sensed this ancestral memory, the cipher, when I melded with the Thorian. Our identities merged, our minds intertwined. Such knowledge... I need that there knowledge. There is a way. Try to relax, Commander. Slow, deep breaths. Let go of your physical shell. Reach out to grasp the threads that bind us, one to another. Every action sends ripples across the galaxy. Every idea must touch another mind to live. Each emotion must mark another's spirit. We are all connected. Every living being united in a single glorious existence. Open yourself to the universe, Commander. Embrace eternity. Okay. This is a Slipknot song. Step it, suck! Stay the devil and I! Realize I'm not your... Let's go from six. given you the cipher just as it was given to Saren the ancestral memories of the Protheans are a part of you now what was that commander Shepard are you all right I saw something it still didn't make any sense you have been given a great gift the experience of an entire people okay. it will take time for your mind to hey, process this information well, I just now got every single message that you sent me over the past day and a half. It, they just now showed up. In time, it will help you understand the vision from the beacon. Okay. Do you know what the conduit is or where it is? No, I'm sorry. All I know is that Saren believes the conduit was the key to the Prothean extinction. Then whatever it is, we cannot let him have it. Word. You have the cipher. In time, your visions will clear. They will lead you to the conduit. I only pray you find it. You the conduit know. is the citadel, right? Is there anything else you can tell when me? When the about? creature enveloped me, I became part of it. 
but I still don't truly understand it. So alien, so ancient. Its exact age is impossible to know. It measured time differently. 10,000 years of hibernation broken by a few frantic centuries of activity. Its mind was awesome, magnificent. It transcended all classification. And now it is gone. Don't tell me you feel sorry. The Thorin was a unique life form, a sentient <laughs> being that lived for 3,000 years, maybe more. There is nothing even remotely like it in the known galaxy. I'm grateful you saved me from a life of thraldom. Fair. I cannot help but feel some sorrow. I mean, if there was a way, hey, if there was a way to keep the Thorin alive, that'd have been awesome. What else can you tell me about? There is little I could tell you that you do not. Once I followed him, blind to his true nature. But now I see he's leading the galaxy. I want to know more about you. There is nothing remarkable about <laughs> me. When Benezia revealed her plan to join Saren, she gave her disciples a choice. Only those who were willing had to follow her. Many felt her plan was too dangerous. But I believed in her. I thought she could turn Saren away from his insanity. Instead, we joined him in it. If you allow it, I would like to stay here with the colonists. They have suffered The colonists will need all the help they can get. Thank you, Commander. I can't believe it. Jong says we'll have all the money we need to keep this place running. It's because of you, Shepard. I can't thank you. Yeah, anymore. and only one, uh, only one person died. Where's that lady that hated us? How do you feel about me now, lady? I fought so hard, but any thought of my own uh, has so much pain. I true, I'm your savior. Finding my workstation out in the room. Time to get moving. Just keep in mind what I said. Alright guys, well I don't want to be here. All traces of the Thorian will be destroyed anymore. How you doing, Letter? I never thought forgive my previous inaction, but under the Thorian's <laughs> influence, every thought was examined, filtered. What will you do now that the fighting is over? Fighting's never over. Try to recover my losses. I can have new supplies delivered within weeks. Perhaps the colony will survive after all. Goodbye. I wish you well in your future efforts. Whoa, wait, am I getting fired? Alright, we're getting the fuck out of this planet. Get out of this place. Don't want to be here. Ah. <sighs> <laughs> Get the fuck up off this shithole. Stand by, shore party. Your decontamination. Party. Your okay. shore party. Commander, you look pale. Are you suffering any ill effects from the I was just brain probed. The cipher shook me up a bit. I might be able to help you. I am an expert on the Protheans. If I join my consciousness to yours, maybe we Do can it. make some hurry. We don't have much time. In front of everybody. Relax, Commander. Embrace eternity. Why the black eyes? I look down, what's going is it uh, is it total destruction of everything? It is a distress call. A message sent out to cross the Prothean Empire. A warning against the Reapers. But the warning came too late. What about the conduit? There were other images, locations, places I recognize from my research. Ilos! The conduit is on Ilos! 
That is why Saren needed to find the Mew Relay. It is the only way to get to Ilos. We have to get to Ilos. Forget it. The Mew Relay's inside the Terminus systems. Alliance ships are not welcome. The conduits there. on Ilos. That's what Saren will have his entire fleet orbiting Ilos. You will never make it. I am sorry. The joining is exhausting. Dr. Chalkwash should That take will a not be necessary. I just need some rest. Somewhere quiet. We're done here. Dismissed. Dr. Tassoni. This is a rather. What are you talking I about? I should have seen this guy. I am a what, what are you talking about? about I'm not jealous. I'm confused. I, mean, I thought we had something, ma'am. I, I, I am not exactly a woman. Yeah, man. but you look. All right, Shepard. Make a choice. If you're not serious, I've got a lot of work to do. Come on. I feel bad for him, Shepard. I hope he'll be okay. I'll go talk with him in a while. I suppose you're right. I don't believe we should continue this discussion here in the. It. <laughs> Fucking. Caden, you didn't get a like. If you just talk to him at all, the dude immediately like wants to jump your fucking bones. Whatever. I'm also not good at navigating stuff like that. So. All right. <clears throat> I assume we gotta fly there. Well, before we do that, let's go talk to our, uh, our girlfriend. Or whatever. I mean, she's not really a girlfriend. She's just a person. Well, I mean, well, girlfriend. You know what I mean. You know what I mean. Like, I mean, she's our partner. They are our partner, whatever. They are our partner. They're about to be. Commander, a... are you coming to check up on me? You look much better. How Dr. Chakwas assures me I am going to be fine. I was impressed with her knowledge. You're still of impressed with it? Quiet. You're in good hands. Dr. Chakwas knows what she's doing. I get the feeling you want to ask me something, Commander. Oh, yeah, I want to ask you something. I like talking with you, Liara, no matter what the subject. You have been very understanding with me, Shepard. Very patient. I appreciate that. I know there are some strange beliefs about my people. I am familiar with the legend of Asari promiscuity, but those rumors have little basis in fact. When one of my people joins with an individual oh, from another species, it is a very different <laughs> Drop my phone. Uh. Do not enter lightly into a union. You make it sound almost mystical. A true union goes far beyond an ordinary melding. It is a connection that transcends the physical universe. Two become <laughs> one. Thoughts and senses merge. Identities intertwine. Memories and emotions weave themselves together, becoming entangled in a single rapturous whole. It is unlike any other experience. In some cases, it can be a truly life-changing event. <laughs> Sounds amazing. No. Oh, no. Uh, I am not big. <laughs> the union is more than just sex. It is the lifeblood of my species. The way we Asari. That is why I have never... Uh, I mean, that is why we must choose our partners with great care. I want you to be absolutely I sure. am only 106. Barely an adult by Asari standards. And <laughs> I spend... Oh, wow. <laughs> I'd be on death's I door. Really thought about it. Not until I met you. You I'm, are very I'm on death's door. I live like a garbage. What happened? Saren, the Geth, the Reapers. I do not know if we are ready for this. I think we have to. Go, I don't know. These are dark. Times. I'm glad you understand, Shepard. I wish it did not have to be that way. But we all have to make sacrifices. I should go. Goodbye, Shepard. Don't you have to sit there and go like, nah, but we are ready, dog. I don't actually care, for the record. For the record. Since we all know Garrus is our true, our one true love. You know, it's, 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 it's weird, because it's like, if in real life, that would be very shitty to just date somebody else, because you couldn't date the person you wanted to date. 
Like that would be garbage. Looking for supplies? Let's see what you, you bet, Commander. It doesn't matter. We can't do that anyway. About two million dollars. Seem to get a lot. Whoops. Damn, that's got a fucking massive. Hell yeah, brother. Fuck Garrus for a second. Commander, I. What can I do for? Something bothering you? It's Saren. He's always one step ahead of us, and he's got those damn gads. We're getting close, Garrus. I wish I had your confidence. I know you're doing everything you can, and if anyone can catch him, it's you, but <laughs> if there's anything else I can do to help, anything, just tell me what you want me to do, and I'll do it. I understand you're concerned, but we will find him. Yes, ma'am. You can count on me. Thanks for hearing me out. I appreciate it. Can I ask you something, Commander? <laughs> no, what goodbye. Are you were I mean they were really dragging their heels before. What if we find him, bring him back to the Citadel, and they refuse to act? You seem to have some thoughts on this. Well, maybe we shouldn't give them in my opinion, Saren's too dangerous. If we find him, when we find him, I say we make sure we stop him permanently. I'm glad you see it that way. I never had any Good. intention. But you see this you never have to worry about bureaucratic idiots making a mess of everything. Just make sure you're ready when Yes, ma'am. Rex, talk to my boy. Oh, that's it. Nothing. I just came to say hey. Oh, we should also talk to uh, best girl. Best girl. Dolly! Shepard, I'm glad you're here. Good to see you smiling again. I'm sleeping much better now. I guess I'm getting used to how quiet your ship is. I still think a lot about my pilgrimage, though. I know Saren's our top priority, but with all the worlds we go to, I was hoping to find something to bring back to the flotilla. We've still got a long way to go. Yes, but it cannot just be some derelict ship my people can use for salvage. It has to be more than What's so special about you? It's my father. He's the senior member I mean, of the Omnarch. What's not special about her dog? He's one of only five people who can overrule the decisions of the Conclave for the good of the migrant fleet. My father is responsible for the lives of 17 million people. Our entire race is in his hands, and I'm his only child. So are you some kind of heir to the Quarian throne or something? No, it doesn't work that way. My father's position isn't hereditary. I'll probably never serve on the Admiralty board myself. Officially, I'm just the same as any other citizen. But it doesn't work that way in practice. Never does. People have always treated me differently because of who my father is. You must get all kinds of special... I probably had it easier than most growing up. But it's not all good. People like my father have enemies. And they're not above using me to get to him. That must be tough on you. My people place a high value on family and ancestry. There's an unspoken expectation that I'll live up to my father's example. Everyone's waiting for me to do something great on my pilgrimage. Something that will forever change our lives for the better. If I don't, it's like I failed. And that reflects badly on both me and my father. The work you're doing here is more important. Yes, I know. But you have to understand that <laughs> our greatest dream is that one day, we'll... there's still millions of Geth behind the veil. Until they're gone, our exile will continue. What do you need to bring back to make everyone happy? Something that would help us better understand the Geth. We've done our best to study them, but it's not. And all the Geth we run into now are understanding. 
But I don't want this to get in the way of our mission, Shepard. First we stop Seren, then I'll worry about my own. See you later. Got a lot of side quests that we're probably never gonna finish. Because we're here at the, we're kind of here at the end game, and I kind of just want to go do it. <laughs> <laughs>